What is the Calgary Expo? Sometimes erroneously called the Calgary Comic Con, the Calgary Comic and Entertainment Expo is a four-day convention held each spring at Stampede Park in, you guessed it, Calgary. The Expo focuses not only on comic book culture, but on many peripheral cultures, including movies, television, sci-fi, fantasy, anime, and cosplay. 2015 was the convention's 10th year and hosted over 104,000 attendees. And there was something for every one of them. Celebrities, vendors, writers, cosplayers, fans, creators, workshops. But instead of just telling you, let's find out what actual attendees of the convention had to say. Is this your first time at the Calgary Expo? This is my first time at the con. This will be my second time attending the Expo. No, this is my third year. What, one, two, I think this is my fourth. This is my fifth time. No, this is actually my sixth time at the Calgary Expo. This will be my eighth year. Eighth year of attending the con in various aspects, yeah. What keeps you coming back? What's your favorite thing about the Calgary Expo? I just love the experience. I don't come here for costume contests or anything like that. It's just about the experience of fans, basically. I really like being here with my friends and hanging out with them and being nerdy together. Just an awesome place to like hang out and see what people make and check out all the costumes and when you dress up to have people taking pictures with you and stuff. It's just a nice environment and it's awesome. I'd say I'm more of a fan of the entertainment side than the comic side. So when you get the big names like Neil Patrick Harris and Hayley Atwell, that's really what draws me. That's the kind of fan I am is the TV shows. So next year I'm hoping maybe they'll get some Battlestar Galactica people or some more Walking Dead people. That's what brings me here. I'll be honest, it's the attention. That's, that's the truth, it really is. Showing off all the work is really what I like to do. Everything here kind of sparks my interest. Got games, got comics, got like movies. It's all kind of all right up my alley. So everywhere I look, I see something that kind of piques my interest. There's a lot about it that I really enjoy. What's your favorite costume you saw this year? I really love the root costume. That was fantastic. I really liked the like Brotherhood guy from uh, Fallout, and there was some really good uh, other Mass Effect ones too, of course. So. Well, you know what? Actually, there was a group of the evil folks from Batman, and there was just a group of them, and they were really good, and that's ones I've liked so far. Oh, there's so many really, really good ones. We got stuff all. There's been quite a few. Ooh, my favorite costume. Yesterday, there was two great Baymax costumes that I saw. One was the big red Baymax in the armor, but then I also saw this adorable little girl who had little pigtails and she was the puffy balloon Baymax. And I took her picture because she was just adorable. What was your number one highlight of this year's expo? I really like the, the panels. Meeting Jason Momoa, it was so awesome. He was so cool, he was so tall. He was so super chill and he was really, really, really nice. And I made so many new friends this year, which I love about the Expo as well. Neil Patrick Harris. I got a photo up with Neil Patrick Harris. I touched him. Number one highlight was going with my husband to get David Morrissey's signature. He's the governor in The Walking Dead and we're huge Walking Dead fans. Just finding some of the comics I've been looking for, like going around doing some shopping. I found some neat, neat items, but I guess I'll go with uh, meeting Carl Weathers. Uh, gotta meet him, so that was pretty cool. What's the appropriate age for someone coming to the expo? Well, I do believe that it is appropriate for her age, for sure. She's 12. I see lots of kids and they cater to them somewhat. I mean, I saw Quidditch earlier in the afternoon, so I, it was fun. And I think that it's appropriate for almost all ages. They've got a kids section with like bouncy castles and stuff like that, Lego Playstations. So I see like a lot of younger kids, kids in strollers. But then you also see some older people like, I don't know, it's kind of an all ages event. This is a generational convention. And what I mean by that is you can see everything from the smallest child to the oldest adult. I've seen people here that are in their 80s and there's no extreme from one or the other. It's a gentle slope from smallest to tallest, youngest to oldest. Older people as well who are dressing up and they're still big comic book fans from when they were kids. And I love that too. So I don't think there is an age appropriate. I think that everybody should be able to partake in the magic. What's your number one piece of advice for someone coming to the expo for their first time? Advice for someone coming for the first time? Wear comfortable shoes. I would say comfortable shoes would be the first thing I would look at. Good walking shoes. Be okay waiting in lines. And because of that, you gotta wear comfortable shoes. Always wear comfortable shoes. When you're at war heels, I die. Bring your own ball of water. Bring cash because a lot of vendors only take cash, especially food vendors. Bring 
Uh, so you can buy all the merchandise and stuff. And some places don't take credit card or, you know, Visa or debit. Lots of cash. Set a budget stick to it. As soon as I buy my ticket, I actually start like a separate account that I just put towards expo fund. <laughs> Probably bring a bag. The last thing you want to do is be packing stuff around in your arms. It's handy to have like a backpack or something. Also, you know, if you want to dress up, then go for it. Just have fun. Don't be scared to ask people for pictures. We're all people too. It would be to get a deluxe pass, like go all weekend. Don't just go one day. Read up before you get here. Read all of the rules and all of the info on the website first. So you can prepare yourself for what you need here. And keep your eye on the panels to make sure that you get to see the stars that you really want to see. I love Calgary Expo. They say uh, Disneyland is the most magical place on earth. I say that Calgary Expo. <laughs>